Moron, noun. A person who is notably stupid or lacking in good judgment. Pandemic, adjective. Prevalent throughout an entire country, continent, or the whole world. Hi guys. And, you know, some games, well... Some of the games just... Well, they just don't work out, do you? So... Anyone who's been watching me stream will have noticed that I often call people morons and I have used the term phrase world of morons and hence that's re resulted in this video stream. You're going to see a top five morons today in this video. Top five. Um, yeah, so we're, we're about to see our first moron right now, actually, after less than 50 seconds. Wow. Yep. But there was a point in this game where this guy was going to be the first moron. Um, he was going to be moron number one. Simply because of the fact that he'd uh, toppled his tank at such an early point in the game. But, as luck would have it, there's more morons in this game. And, and to find the next moron, we need to spit jump the, uh, the enemy team replay. And here we are on the enemy team. And it wouldn't be a, <laughs> a video about morons, would it, if it didn't have, a, didn't have an artillery in it. I mean, well, you can't just call him a moron because he's artillery. Well, no, I can't. I would want to, but I'm afraid I can't. Um, please ignore the Jed Kinnis of this, by the way. It's the replay thing. But just look where his team is. He's rapidly outpacing his team at a fair old pace of knots. He's gone dark at this point, so we're going to have to jump back into the other replay and see what happens to him. He's... There's none of his team within view range that we can see. There was one guy here. He pushed all the way out to that corner at the start, outpacing most of the rest of his team. And he's gone and parked himself in the corner where it's kind of obvious that the enemy team are going to push. Yep. That's moron number two right there. Now, if we just pause the video at this moment in time, um, you can see that the next moron on our team is actually already dead. He's not on his side, but he's already dead. Um, we we'll have to take a jump back in time and find him, aren't we? And find out what happened to him. Here we are with the enemy team once again. Um, with Jamie. And we'll, we're going to find out what happens very shortly. To uh, Moron number three. As he, is it going to be the Churchill? Is Moron number three to the Churchill? Oh, hang on, no. It's an OI who drives out sideways on and loses most of his health within one shot. Moving on over to Mr. Churchill, we can see what's happening to him. He's now got no fucking health left. But he still carries on pushing. He goes invisible, but we can see where he's going. Uh, push through the trees. Push the cat. Got a lot of health though, is he? So why is he heading? You'd think he'd be willing, wanting to spare his health a bit at this point, wouldn't he? There he is, he's right near the front. He's now side scraping against um stuff. And he tried a shot and He's dead. There we go. More on number three. We're into the top two guys. So here we are with more on number two in his box tank. Um What's he done? What, what, what's this guy going to do wrong exactly, do you think? I mean, he's playing the middle line, well, he's got a lot of health left. Going to throw his health away, surely? I mean, he's playing on the road. Nothing behind him, that's quite safe. I mean, he, he, he's not sure what he needs to kill. He's thinking maybe about pushing in or going round to our flank. Not sure what he wants to do, I don't think. He's going to cross. He's, he's made a decision, he's going to cross. And he's going to cross, and he's... G oh. And he's in, um... Yeah. Well, he's done that. Second tank in the game. More on number two. And, uh, look, let's just see if we can... See, he can't really get his gun to bear on anything up there, which would be useful if he could. He's managed to get himself fallen over in the spot 
where he can't actually do anything. He can't shoot that gap. He can't shoot that gap. He can shoot that house, but there's not a lot of use, is it, shooting that house? Um. Now, here we had a, co a contender for one of the morons in the game. He drove past him, didn't offer any help. But this guy obviously hasn't asked for help. So the strip's going, and he... Uh, going and he loses all of his health right about now there we go let's just drive out in front of the enemy team and lose all our health yay congratulations let's just speed this up and see how long this lasts so the mr striv he's here for a while i think um sorry not mr striv mr mr box tank's here for a while mr striv's not here for much longer but he's with his 11 health but yeah there he goes There he is, he's back, and any second now. There we have it. So then, what does that leave us with? Well hang on, there's only a KV2 with six kills, and a Hummel left alive. There can't possibly be any more morons in this game. I mean a KV2 with six kills is going to be a moron. And to be honest, we know that that KV2 is Jamie. And although Jamie can be a moron, he certainly wasn't in this game. Because he ends up with 8 kills. And 5,000 damage. And a fucking plethora of badges and rewards. In fact, there were only two real players in this game who weren't morons. And that was very probably Skull Member and Jamie. So who's the other moron? Who's the biggest moron in the game? Well, guys... We're going to have to take a time warp back to the start of the game to find out who the biggest moron is. Come with me. So here we are, back at the start of the game, and um, we're back with moron number five again. Well, how can this be? This guy can't be moron number five and number one, can he? No, he can't. But the way this kind of folded out, this was live on stream, um, on school member stream. And if you... Uh, want to see school member stream his link is in the video below and we're going to have maybe a bit of video footage of him in it shortly as well and we're going to see what his reaction is to this guy here when he finds out that he's well <laughs> lying on his side um, <laughs> what is going on here Lucky. why has nobody killed him yet <laughs> because they're both on the fucking side are you having a fucking laugh? Oh no. <laughs> oh my fucking. Both get a fucking. In action bot. In action oh, well. bot. Okay, Jamie. <laughs> Jamie, go farm, buddy. <laughs> Jamie has his game of the, his life with the tank. Yeah, this is handed to him on a plate. Like, seriously, how did Mummy, how how did he not die by the KV-2, right? The KV-2 should have died when he shot me and he was still alive. Like, how did he survive when he shot me? <laughs> That's a Colobon of Enter Rekli Voltas. <laughs> Fucking idiot teammates, man. How do you roll here with a Hellcat? <laughs> Magic is <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> I swear to god, why do we always get the fucking dumbass fucks on our team? The best thing is it's back as into the enemy's side. How did he get this? <laughs> fucking Christ man, you do a thousand damage and the fucking team just doesn't even understand how to fucking use their own gun. He won't fail, there is no failing. He can just roll up to the fucking arty, then kill the Hellcat, and then he's done. 4k damage from oh, Bradley Walters and Kolobanov metal. Go. What the fuck? More to the point, why did no one help him to get right? Yeah, he left the game anyways, by the way. He's not here. Did you type in chat? I'll see if it's helped. So they already died as well. No, he didn't put in chat help. He just flipped and then left. Instant.
No, he's put no help at all. Oh, well, yeah, help get here. Help. In the first... Oh, my God, he flipped in the first 20 seconds. There we had it. Scully wasn't too happy with his team, was he? As they were full of idiots. I mean, we've got more on number five here. He just flipped. No one can understand how he's flipped, but we've seen it at the start of the game. He took the corner far too wide and tried to drive up the face of the house. But looking at the map, I mean, this guy pings for help. Is there anyone in a position that could maybe help him? I mean, seriously, looking at that map now, there's this heavy tank. He's, he's pinging for help now. He's pinging for help now, isn't he? He's pinging for help now. Who's that at the bottom of the map about to drive past him? I mean, surely that's not, that's not, that's not, that's not, that's not, that's not Tone Def, is it? Hang on, I'm sure Tone Def said this later on. Is that Hellcat on his side? 8 minutes 34. Can't be right. That can't be right because it's 13.49. He's just driven past the Hellcat. So what we're saying is that the turn literally just drove past the Hellcat as he was on his side. And the Hellcat even tried to fire at him to get his attention. But turn. We're past. How do you think Scully would have reacted to that? Embarrassing for the. Oh my. I'm going to show this, boys. Are you all <laughs> ready? Are you guys ready for this? <laughs> Are we all ready for this? Remember the Hellcat that flipped that I had an absolute go at because, you know, he was flipped and no one knew that he was flipped. Remember that Tone was in my game. Oh, we won. He's in the other side, how you yeah. can get... <laughs> I never noticed! He <laughs> presses... The, map the, worst, time. the worst part is, he's clicking the SOS button! Right when you're next to him, he SOSs. <laughs> Let, let's all, all blame uh, Tone for that one. <laughs> Tone is well, part of that idiot that, team. Please, if I didn't do that, Ginge wouldn't have got his eight kills, would he? <laughs> yeah, well, that would have been great. <laughs> I'm waiting for my glasses, to be honest. I've been. <laughs> this makes me want to cry. World of morons, world of fucking tone. <laughs> this is just Town's Area 2.0. <laughs> I was like, why am I this? Maybe I'll join Philo, I don't know. Well, maybe. <laughs> Philo X is waiting for you. You can be their XO. <laughs> there you go. We won. Yeah, we won. We carried Tone, his deaf, ass. and blind. <laughs> <laughs> so, there we have it, folks. Moron number one. Turn deaf. Who? Drove past the poor unfortunate Hellcat. It was moron number five. In this this game that was simply a pandemic of morons. Um, from both sides. Uh, and having the watch replay from Ginger's point of view, there could have been far, far more more morons in this team. But we can't take it away from Ginger because Ginger actually had a really, really good game. It kind of shows what happens when you're playing against a team of morons. And there you can see Jamie's results. He got an ace tanker, a bruiser, duelist, fire for effect. Fucking Radley Walters medal for getting eight kills. Well, a Banoff's medal for standing alone against five or more players. Albeit two of them were on their sides. Leap, being idiots. Steel wall, high caliber, tank sniper, and a top gun. He did a whacking 12 shots, 12 hits, 12 pens. 5,210 damage in his KV2. That is an awesome performance. Regardless of who you're against, that is really a performance of a lifetime. It is utterly, utterly fantastic. Well done, Jamie. He may have been firing gold, but then he's not called Gold Gingy for nothing, is he? If you look at the team score, you can see he was top by a mile. He had four players on his team who did zero damage. All could have gone 
in the uh, the Marlon category. Uh, three on Billy's team. Um, and bizarrely enough, Hearn actually had quite a decent game, despite being a moron. So there we have it, folks. And so, as the sun sets on Jamie putting the last of the morons out of his misery, getting his eighth kill, colour banoffs, everything else, I'd like to thank, you all remember, Jamie, Hearn Def, Stephen War. For uh, allowing me to do this video. For all the morons out there. Keep on being morons. We couldn't produce content like this without you. Thanks for watching guys. If you like the video please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more content like this. Please hit the subscribe button. Um, I'm also on Facebook as Average Tanker. On Twitch as Slimes40k. And I'm on Twitter as 40 k Slimes. All of which you can see on the screen right now and I copied in the link below also in the description below you'll find a link to skill members twitch stream so if you want to go give him a follow that would be really really appreciated all right guys thanks a lot and I'll see you all again next time and hopefully you won't be in it please allow me to introduce myself I'm a man of wealth and peace I rode a tank, held a general's rank When the front line drained and the team just sank Whoa! Pleased to meet ya Don't you guess my name? Oh yeah! Oh, what's puzzling you is the nature of this game Ha ha!